Hello everyone. Down here at my second homestead. Come to check on these two trees. I have a shoot pomegranate here. That I need to come get all the dead limbs out of. And I have a I think this is a brown turkey that I've been pulling dead limbs out of. Um, so this is part when I say I got fig trees, two of them, a fig is here and a pomegranate is here. So I'm going to have to get the um, some type of saw for this because this thing has stickers on it. But as I thought it had died last year, but as you see, it's coming back. I just need to get all the dead materials out of it and bring some... Um, Maybe some fertilizer down here and try to help it this year. As you see, it did have pomegranates on it last year, but I didn't pick them. But it's my plan this year to fertilize it and see what I can get to produce down here. This is the property I deer hunt on. I need to make sure nobody's taking my deer stand down here. I hope not. But it's so peaceful out here in the country. Now this is really the country compared to my other where I live. It's time for me to come down here and start mowing as you can see. But I'm not gonna do it this weekend. I'm gonna garden. I'll come down here next weekend and uh, do my first cutting of the year. down here just walking and looking see a black butterfly or a brown butterfly I can't see I really need to get out here today and get them on. And it's going to have to wait the next week. I don't feel like it. This is a three and a half to four hour job. So, And all this area you see here from that those trees back to where I am used to be a garden. Uh, my stepdad Benjamin had a garden out here. And you might can see the rows if, I, if, the, if it's filming good enough. He had it fenced in. And there's the fence that used to go around the garden. But yeah, this has grown up. I need to get myself down here. But uh, y'all stuff just come and dig holes and I think they're armadillos, but I'm not real sure. But it's okay. It's just the price you pay when you have property it has to be upkeep. The upkeep up on it is. But that's for my brother. <laughs> As we bring his lawn more back. That's my oldest brother. It was four of us, and now it's only three of us. My middle brother passed away in 2019. Filming. I need to be out here mowing. But yeah. As I've said before, this is the property my mom left me. She only had two children. My dad had four. So I have two brothers, by, additional brothers. But that's my brother by my mom there. So, I was the only girl, but they treated me just like a boy, uh, and tough. I played football and everything with the fellas, with the guys in the in the neighborhood. They used to call me Tank, because I was tough. I was a true tomboy. 
believe it or not. I'm trying to see if that deer stand is still down there. Guess I can walk. I mean, something's been really digging. But, uh, yeah, I need to get my mower out. Come down through here. I, I need to be careful because I don't have anything on me, and I know maybe some wild hogs, but gonna walk and see. As you see, my deer stand over there, but I'm getting a new one. This one's going to be enclosed. Um, I've been priced it already. Oh yeah, the other deer stand, I can see it. Oh my. So, I'm going to head back up this way. You can just come sit out here absolutely hear nothing and do some thinking if you really needed to think about things clear your mind because it's quiet as heck out here but I love it and that's what a lot of people are going for now they're trying to move in the country get in a country setting to get away from the hustle and bustle of being in town or being in the bigger cities but uh this show pass. I love it. The older I get, the quieter I want it. Who are those? Dragonflies? So, and my neighbor over here, next door, I don't know if you can see all that, but he cut down all of that over there and it looked like he tried to burn it. But it's a beautiful windy day out here at the end of March. We haven't had any wind blowing in the month of March. And what is it? Close to the last day of March. And here comes the wind. And you know what? We used to fly kites in March. But I don't even know if they sell kites anymore because the wind doesn't blow like they used to. That was a thing for us as kids flying kites. Flying kites. But I hadn't flown a kite in years, like I said. I bet my grandkids don't even know anything about a kite. What are you doing today? But yeah. So you mowed your yard today? Yeah, we're going to have to go out of the wild and see them more. Probably a tractor. Put it back on there. Hey, brother. What's going on, Rachel? How are you? I'm all right. You feel me? I'm on. A this is my older brother. For YouTube. <laughs> my oldest brother. Oh. What are you getting into? Yeah, I was intending to get some yesterday when I was at Home Depot, but I forgot about it. Yeah, well, it's two filters on the bottom of that mower. On each side, each wheel got a filter on it. Uh huh. Yeah, a hydraulic filter. One of them will leak in it, but it would. Oh, okay. It's a cover on it. You can't see. You got to take the cover off of it. Oh, so you got it fixed? Yeah, I fixed it about a couple weeks ago. If you go to Home Depot, get their stuff, I'll give you money back. I get some, I get some, I go there, I get some of them anyway, you know. But any, who y'all? I get it. I get the car place. It's all hard drive. My trailer, well, one of my trailers, my brother always borrows it because I, as, as country as I am, I've been trying to learn how to drive a truck and a trailer. My husband, he's not a good teacher because he likes to fuss. Time I turn the wrong direction because you kind of have to go the opposite of where you're trying to go. Turn the opposite direction. I got that part down, but my mind and my hands are not connecting with that. But oh, the sun's coming up. But anywho, y'all, I'm going to let you go. I came down to uh, finish doing something uh, in my kitchen that we were renovating. Hold on, I'll just take you guys in the house to see the kitchen. Me and my husband were renovating the bathroom also. We're about 95% finished with it, too. But, uh, 
It's just taking longer than I expected. Or that I want. You know, because we both work full time. You know, you have to do stuff. And I work a lot of overtime. So, we have to work. Edit when we can. And everything. And big four leaf, three leaf covers. This is a pretty flower. What kind it is. But my mom planted it. Here so before she passed. And me and her planted these hedges. That I need to come down here and clip. The year before she passed. He was just dying. To have these little ugly hedges. But anywho. Kitchen that I'm renovating. So, like I said, I just left the original cabinets and just repainted because um, those are solid wood. So, I never got something new. It was not going to be probably of the quality. And if I got the quality of the um, cabinets I wanted, it was going to cost a lot of money. And I wasn't trying to invest that kind of money at a property no one lives at. So, I think we did pretty good. My brother helped me paint. Lights been off down here. And um let me go upstairs. I'm looking in the bathroom because I haven't been down here in a minute. I have some bugs. But this kitchen, I mean this bathroom did at one time, as you see, we're not finished. Had that pink towel in here. And I had the countertops put in and um my husband did all the shiplap looking work and we got we're not quite finished but we got a it's it's looking decent it's not professional but it's decent for us to have done it my husband did the flooring too so i'm proud of him so we got to take it out to the hall but we are definitely working on this only thing i did was paint and i got to come back and finish that i had to putty that and i painted over there but anywho, I think we're doing a pretty good job at it. So we plan to bring the same flooring out here. I have it somewhere bought already. But uh let's get the light off. But that's what I do in my spare time. Just work or garden or working at my job or hey, do you need some water? So I do work a lot, you guys. So And I'm trying to, y'all overlook all my junk. And I broke glass and I'm going to put some flooring down in this little sunroom. But, like I said, don't live here, but I'm trying to get it renovated. I love my little goalie mask. But anywho, I'm going to get off this phone. Go ahead and cut this light off and go home and get in the garden. And, um... Uh, this property would strictly probably be used for let me do something to drink um like family gatherings so we'll have to buy a place we'll have a decent place to live because this this house has three could be four bedrooms my mom them had a den downstairs and one two two and a half baths so got a long way to go or as renovating goes but Nobody lives here. All the utilities on. A real could come live now. Just depends on, you know. Um, if I want to come down here and live. But I don't right now, so. I get nervous sometimes. I have spent the night down here and I feel anxious when I do. Because my mom died in the living room. So, you know, she was on hospice. But I know she wouldn't come back to do anything to me. But anywho, I'm going to get off this phone so I can go get in my garden. But you guys have a great day. So keep uh, gardening and growing. Bye-bye. Have a great day.